Hi, hi it's Mike with AskTractorMike.com. This is Wes, my neighbor. Wes is getting ready to move his little portable building with a tractor. And we're thinking this may be an epic fail video. <laughs> Quite possible. Come on up to the camera real quick, Wes. We're, we're actually trying to get done before the rain yeah, comes trying Yeah, trying to beat the rain and trying to move this thing about 200, 250 yards. I don't know if it's going to work. The board we have underneath the front is barely wide enough. And, and uh, we're going to see how my redneck rigging works out here. Underneath the front of this thing, Wes has a, a play gym uh, beam that was left by the people that owned our place before we moved there. And it's 30 years old and it's mowing a little bit. But when we moved, we moved this down here with the tractor, that went well, but we were dragging it. We were dragging it. And now you get, you're trying to put it up somewhere where you, you have to have the tractor inside of it. In order the entire thing up to, to make it happen. Yeah. So, I don't know. We'll, uh, we'll see how it goes. Little wind, this could turn into a disaster. Uh, yeah. uh, little gravity, uh, the things want to go this way, so we'll see what happens. We're going to give it a try. All right. Show me how you hook that up there. I hook this up. Well, I, I just, uh, what I did is put a sling each direction to kind of pinch it in a little bit to keep it from going side to side because this board was just barely, barely wide enough. 
pick it up. It really made me nervous. In fact, I about decided to not do it. But I uh, come up with the idea to put these two slings and strap strap it and center it best I could, and it worked great. Centered it with the tractor. Yeah, centered it with the tractor. It wouldn't or wouldn't move. Wouldn't go left or right. Wouldn't go left or right. All right, let's go around the back. Okay. Use the three point there. Use the three point. I used a uh, another one of those big timbers that I had, and uh, this is actually a, a body a body uh, uh, lift for uh, putting on a car rotisserie. Give it some backbone and put it under the whole unit, and then use these chains to kind of pinch it in against that board and up at the same time. I change it, change it up and down here, and then side to side, and it worked great. Three point, three point, let it do all the work. And, and you were changing your height all the way up there because it doesn't look like much of a hill. I'm sure on the video it won't, but there's pretty good hill you we came up. Yeah, the back I had it high enough. I didn't have to change it much, but the front it was constant up and down with the with the tilt of the pallet forks and man it worked great this tractor phenomenal for uh i guess like they say uh let the machinery do the work work smarter or harder and it did a great job and you've just about got where you want it the rest will be manual scooting it around getting yeah it, and and getting it level and everything yeah because i want to get it right against this building and trying to level it and get it just right and I've got to get this up, this uh, bar out of the way underneath to get it where I want it. So but it worked out great. Uh, the the thing I like about Wes, your, your speed is about the same speed as I would be doing if I were doing that, which is no speed at all. Yeah, you're better off to take it take it easy and do it right the first time because you get in a hurry and it, things fly apart and then you, you're behind anyway. So no need to get in a hurry. Just do it do it slow and steady. Slow and steady and safe gets the job done. Yep. I appreciate you watching my videos. I'd be honored if you'd subscribe to my YouTube channel, and you can do that by clicking the Mike Face icon and checking the bell so you're notified when I post future videos. Here's a link to my website and the Tractor Fun Store with unique items for sale for the tractor owner that help support my YouTube channel. And here's another video you might want to watch. Thanks for watching.